Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to be showing you the best chatbot you can build on VoiceFlow. It has a bunch of functionalities combining AI, human interaction, automations, everything you can think of that you can build on VoiceFlow. This chatbot has it, it connects to multiple platforms and it's perfect for any type of business. Let's jump into the computer. Okay guys, so this is the bot right here. As you can see, you've been invited to have a conversation with Legion chatbot template and you can just click start a conversation. It's gonna ask for the name and it's gonna give a few options. You can customize this, of course, our services work with us. Let's say they want to work with us. Okay, we're gonna do Diego, what's your email? You submit all the information and then the information is gonna go through this webhook. It's gonna add a road to Google Sheets to keep the storage, add a contact to the CRM, send them an email and you know send the message to a team uh regarding the notification that someone just submitted a form and this makes it so much easier because uh, a person doesn't need to like fill up of a contact form and instead it can just interact with this chat bot and it makes it just so much easier the template for the bot is down below in the description just click the first link and i'm gonna be sending that to your email and as you can see here is a chat bot on voice flow i'm gonna go over this in detail but first let's go over the platforms okay the platform you will need for this bot mainly is voice flow uh, you can start building on this is free for 14 days and it's basically the best platform out there for building a bot like this and then you need make.com which is basically the competitor to Sapier. you can use Sapier as well but with this basically you get access to tons and tons of apps so that you can combine your best to you know your your voiceful bot and not only for the bot but scaling your your business number three you need many chat this is just going to be to connect your bots not only to your website which comes in integrated with voiceful but with many chat you get the option to connect it to instagram to Facebook Messenger, to WhatsApp, and even to Telegram if you want to do that. So yeah, that's what I did with my clients. Uh, he wanted uh, his chatbot to be integrated with multiple platforms, and that's where we integrated with ManyChat. Okay, here we are on VoiceFlow. I'm going to start showing you how I built this out. First, let's go to the content uh, tab over here, and first you need to add your knowledge base. You, to add a knowledge base, you just click here, add a data, and you're just going to click your website. The DA is going to be trained based on your website, okay? Now, you're going to click to intents. Uh, this is to for the chatbot to detect when the, the user wants to talk to a human, for example. When the user wants to see the case studies and the one the user wants to do a call. And I when this happens, I have it directed so that it goes automatically to that branch. So talk to your human intent. You need to generate phrases yourself and add them until the confidence level is 100 out of 100. Okay. As you can see here, you can see all the transcripts of all the conversations you have with the bot, all the analytics, the integrations it has. And yeah, that's it for us for the, as for the settings part. And let's go over the build. Okay, so as he, as you can see here, it starts with the welcome capture. It stores the, the name in a variable, which you can create a variable right here. So over on listen, you can create a variable where it says capture and you just create a variable. Then it goes over to our services, work with us, our case studies, send a proposal. Whenever the, the user uh, chooses, it's going to go over to the bot and here is a part where it actually utilizes ai you can try test out the bot right here so let's say the user wants to go directly to the service here are main services branding and strategy and it's actually going to use ai to uh, give a description of the service it wants so, so if i would have put like marketing uh, ad marketing or something like this is going to use AI to analyze the website and what it says about ads and it's just going to give a description about it. Okay, it wants to see more case studies, sure. And it's just going to go to the case studies and here are the case studies. As you can see, they can go to the website, they can see case studies, see clients website and whatever they want to do. So yeah, what would you want to do now? Ask, ask a question or work with us. If they want to ask a question, they will just be led to a, to an AI that answers questions, basically. But 
here is basically a lead collection part where you can send the lead over to another platform called make.com which i'm gonna go over right now so let's say i my email i submit my email etc etc after that it's gonna go over here as for phone number as for phone number what kind of business is it what are you looking for annual revenue and then it's gonna post something called the webhook which is connected directly to make.com with this webhook right here okay so we're gonna test out the the webhook as you can see it actually sends the webhook and adds the lead to google sheets as you can see right here budget um what are they looking for kind of business everything and this is just going to be sent to make.com and then to to a google sheet to a hubspot whatever you want like i'm saying this can connect to almost any application you want if you want gmail if you want google drive whatever you want you can connect it over if not through the application through an api okay now let's go to the intent if the user wants to talk to a human it's gonna automatically detect that and lead them over here to this workflow. Okay, so hello, are you you're now being transferred to the team? What is what is your inquiry or reference of contact today? This is just to be sure that the, the the lead that's contacting us is actually worth to respond to. So they're gonna be asked to to tell the reason why. And okay, okay. And here is the information the the chatbot needs to you know get back to the, the to the customer later on if the chatbot was not of help to the user. So as you can see, this is a complete chatbot, and we had this connected to Intercom, which is a basically a live ticketing system, which if the customer needs live help, you can just connect it to this bot, and uh, you can talk directly to your clients. Now let's test out the bot in the conversation. Let's say the user wants to see the case studies, as you can see, web development case studies. And here are the case studies. I mean, they're so, so, they're looking so, so nice. See client's website, every button works. And what would you like to do now? Uh, it's gonna be work with us. And you're just gonna answer all the emails and answer all the questions and just like that i restarted the conversation and the conversation is gonna appear back in the transcript tab as you can see right here so yeah guys that's pretty much all the bot until now if you have any questions on more components on the bot and what you can add to the bot just let me know but it, it's pretty straightforward it's pretty simple to build as you can see that's a pretty cool tool we just built right here pretty efficient and it saves a lot of time especially when you're getting hundreds and hundreds hundreds of customer service requests every day with the same questions and you just need to streamline the whole thing and guys there's a lot of, of system, systems and processes we are using with AI for our clients and our clients for their clients so if you guys just want to get a full business scan where we completely go into your business ask you all the questions we need and give you a list of actual solutions you have to your current inefficiencies like one would say you can sign up in the link below you can just go and answer a few questions and we will get back to you with a time to talk on a call okay guys that's pretty much it for today and let me know what kind of solutions are you looking to see on youtube as well thank you guys and bye bye